The wind about me. The Trojan cheerleaders and fans had a lot to cheer about at this point in the ball game. Turkey Valley held a 12-7 lead. We're early in the, the second period to play. Uh, Turkey Valley on the defense uh, right here. Uh, we're going to see a fumble recovery. It's hard to see it from here, but it was uh, Nick Schaffenbuehl that, that got the football for Turkey Valley as uh, the Trojans are doing good. Now they recover the ball. They are unable to move it at uh, this uh, point in the game, and, and they, they move back on uh, defense uh, rather quickly, and, and really we're doing an excellent job. Look at all those guys in on there. Brian Schmidt, Luke Kennan, I believe that was Josh Hansmeyer in there. So, so all kinds of guys, and here we're going to see Luke again on uh, defense uh, coming up here in a little bit. Uh, well, there's uh, Dalton Hackman and Jordan Mitchell. There's Luke. Uh, Luke was around the ball, and and here's going to be Luke throwing at the runner for a loss on uh, the, this play, uh, getting back in there. And a uh, big play. So the Turkey Valley defense was excellent. Uh, Nick Schaffenbuehl getting in on there. Josh Hansmeyer was excellent at this uh, point of the game, uh, leading at 12-7. Uh, to 7. Now the Trojans uh, back on offense after uh, the punt. That's uh, Joe Schmidt. Covering up the football good on uh, that run. And now uh, Ben Novotny going in motion, gets the ball. He makes an excellent run, nice blocking, good hole. And he finally got uh, really wrestled down there uh, by the West Branch uh, team. We're inside the 20-yard line in motion. Goes Jordan Mitchell. He gets the ball this time off uh, the right side. And the, the Trojans, everything is, is clicking. Right now, defense, offense, they lead the football game and uh, getting ready for another one uh, right here as uh, Brian Schmidt uh, runs the football hard from that uh, fullback position. Had a big night uh, for Turkey Valley. And uh, now the Trojans will go uh, with the quarterback, uh, Joe Schmidt, uh, for the touchdown, his second of the night, and it's touchdown Turkey Valley, making it 18-7. to at uh, this point in the ball game, and they really looking rosy for Turkey Valley football. Now the two points straight ahead. Touchdown or two-point conversion that time. You see the officials with their arms high in the air, and Turkey Valley led it 20-7. to Back with the kickoff after this. It really is a tradition of excellence and leadership established by the Farmer's Mill in Prodovan since 1964. Not only for the farmer, but the communities from check days to our schools at Trinity and Turkey Valley, as well as our churches and Boy Scout projects, the Merricks and their staff have been there front and center helping the farmer and the community establishing a tradition of excellence since 1964. The Farmer's Mill in Prodovan. Trojans leading it 20 to 7. And now the kickoff, and we're going to see excellent coverage here by the Turkey Valley Trojans on this KO as uh, you see Adam Creener uh, in on uh, the play along with uh, Brian Kuhn. Uh, excellent defense of, on the, those kickoff returns all year by Adam Creener and others uh, for Turkey Valley. Now a couple of uh, runs here by uh, TV as uh, they did stop him uh, rather quickly. And uh, Jordan uh, Mitchell uh, picks up uh, the run. And uh, here's one uh, by uh, Ben Novotny. Actually, uh, West Branch had scored there, too. It's now uh, 20 to 14, I should mention. And uh, we're watching uh, uh, Jordan Mitchell on the run as we're just kind of winding things down uh, at the end of the first half. And uh, we're going to see uh, right now a Ben Novotny run, a pretty good run by Ben on uh, this play coming on the, the left side. Had, he broke a tackle and maybe picked up two or three extra yards uh, once uh, breaking uh, that tackle. So a good job uh, by uh, Ben Novotny on that particular play. And the Trojans were still moving the football, still in control of uh, this football game uh, despite the long run by Kay Jones uh, to set up their uh, second touchdown. There you see the interception by Jordan Schmidt uh, just uh, before the half. 
And uh, Turkey Valley basically uh, ran out the clock. The crowd, uh, really kind of disappointing, I would say. Uh, not a lot of folks there. I don't know if it was because it was Halloween or what, uh, but uh, Turkey Valley uh, takes off the field uh, for halftime, uh, leading it 20 to 14. And everybody had to be optimistic. Turkey Valley was going to get the second half kickoff, so things were looking good as uh, we were entertained at halftime by the Turkey Valley band. That's uh, Robin Kime, who uh, is the, the uh, person that directs them uh, on uh, the field each week. And you see a, a lot of uh, them in their uh, Halloween outfits uh, and they're really doing an excellent job. Not a real big uh, amount of numbers-wise there anymore. Uh, for the band, but uh, those that are there uh, do an excellent job for uh, Turkey Valley as uh, you watch them there. And uh, we're going to watch the, the Trojan Band go off the field, some of them uh, for the very last time at uh, Turkey Valley as they go off the field.